with losing just one game at their home all season. The Seagulls saw goes today. Hello, my beautiful people. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Match Reaction as we give you the match reaction between Brighton and Arsenal, which ended in a 3-0 trashing as Arsenal ran away with all three points from the Amex Stadium. Before I go on, don't forget to like this video, click on the share button, comment on the, the comment section and tell me do you think Arsenal with this kind of performance, they can go all out to win the league? Let me know in the comment section. A little, a little few points I really want to point out today and few players who really stood up today, players like uh, Kai Havat uh, was really, really impressive today for me with a goal and an, an assist also to his name to continue his impressive uh, scoring streak uh, for Arsenal. You remember Kai Havert was attacked as uh, the flop of the season. A lot of people were too rushed to judge uh, Kai Havert, the £60 million pound to drain this set. But right now, I don't know if that £60 million pounds is down the drain or it's uh, going straight to securing the title for Arsenal. Leandro Trossard came in... Uh, uh, to score the third goal to see all three points and uh, not forgetting also Bukayo Saka put Arsenal a goal ahead through the penalty spot as uh, Gabriel Jesus was brought down by Lamptey in the game. So Arsenal keeping the five consecutive clean sheets away from home in 2024. The first time that has happened since 1997. Mikel Arteta is really building a very formidable army and formidable defense has now considered just four goals in 2024 that's uh the same amount of goals by Manchester United and Chelsea cons uh, that's the same amount of goals Manchester United conceded in the hands of Chelsea has lost that game by four goals two three you say uh Asana through the keeper Martin Odegaard has been really been impressive uh Odegaard uh, is the share is the leader of the press for Arsenal as a uh, they are trying everything possible to see if they can win the league after Manchester City have won the league on uh, three consecutive times. So Manchester City are going for a four uh, heat and uh, Liverpool will be hoping also to win it uh, for the second time in Jota Club. Uh, Liverpool career who announced that he was stepping down at the end of the season. Back to the game between Brighton and Arsenal. Arsenal were put on the pressure after Manchester City defeated Crystal Palace by four goals to two today. Kevin De Bruyne scoring a brace in that game. And, and Haaland also returning to the uh, score, a scoring shot after he failed to get a shot on target against Arsenal last week. So I would say... Arsenal are really doing their bit, doing their best and see if they can win the season Premier League. And with the likes of uh, um, Party, the likes of uh, uh, Simba and the likes of uh, Tomiyasu coming back from injury, I think Arsenal are really uh, placed in the right place right now to go all out to win this uh, league with just remaining seven matches to go. So let's see what the remaining games are going to play and uh, how they're going to play at Arsenal will be going away to... Uh, at Manchester United, uh, Totti, and which they had driver, and also Wolverhampton one. This is the last three away games, and I can tell you, if Arsenal can win those three away games, uh, I can beat my chest and tell you, Arsenal will be grand champion. I still have Arsenal to win this season's uh, Premier League. Don't forget that. And uh, uh, Mikel Arteta is sharing the same uh, positivity as I am. I'm good at it, so I have to be positive and I have to back my team. So. Benjamin White returning back to the Amex was impressive today. Also, um, the two central defender Gabriel Magalas and William Rose Roy Saliba. That guy is so cool and so formidable in the defensive lineup in the midfield of a big clan heist. And Eugenio has really, really uh, stable Arsenal midfield. And I think that's the same midfield we're going to see against Bayern Munich. But I'm, I'm hesitant to see if Ateta will go for uh, Thomas Party and uh, Declan Rice in that game. So let's keep our fingers crossed and hopefully we can see a uh, trashing from Arsenal against Bayern uh, Munich. I hope Arsenal win that game. I'm pretty sure Arsenal going to win that game by 4 goals to 1. That's my score prediction for that game. So... Without wasting too much of your time, it's a straightforward win for Arsenal. And they chuck one more game out of the calendar. And now on to Bayern Munich in the Champions League. And don't forget, we'll be giving you a match reaction from that game also. And tomorrow, I will be doing a watch-along party 
for the game between Manchester United and Liverpool. So tell me what do you think is going to end tomorrow match between Manchester United and Liverpool? I want to know in the comments section. Till I see you again, stay safe, bless you, and don't forget, don't forget to like this video. Put on a comment section. If you're not subscribed to the channel yet, please do and support our channel as we grow. Say that, my people. Peace out.